Hi, I'm Sue Gardner. I'm leader of the Mapping and Markers team at Plant and Food Research. My interest in science really goes back to my childhood. I was brought up on a farm and so I've always been a practical sort of person, interested in plants and how things work. I did my PhD at Otago University and there I was trying to nut out how morning glory uh, flowering gets switched on and off by the length of night. During my time in Freiburg in Germany, I then worked with parsley cell cultures and there we were looking at how light controls the synthesis of these pig, uh, pigments. Then I came back to New Zealand and I'm really enjoying my work with apples now at Plant and Food. Right now I lead a team of about 10 to 20 people depending on time of year and our job is to develop a toolbox for apple breeders to help them to uh, breed new varieties of apple much more effectively and cost effectively. And what we do is we identify markers, genetic markers or fingerprints for particular genes that the breeders want, the consumers want, and then use these genetic markers to screen the selections. The potential of this science is absolutely huge for fruit breeders in general, not only apple breeders. The technology means that they can select the plants that they really want to look at with the right combination of genes and just throw the rest in the bin. This saves a lot of money in orchard costs and we can also save a lot of time because the same process actually reduces the number of generations involved in breeding. One of the things I really, really enjoy about science is seeing my markers being used, seeing breeders used by um, markers to select plants that they want. Another thing that I find really, really exciting is to watch my younger members of the team grow as scientists.